full day of action in athletics at Telmec Stadium in Guadalajara on day number two of the Parapan Games. Jacqueline Rennebaum of London, Ontario, competing in the 100 meter heats early in the day. Third lane from the right, and with a good finish, reason for optimism. I really enjoyed the energy from the crowd, and then being here with Simon, my guide runner. It was an amazing feeling representing Canada on, the, on this type of stage. Simon, how did you do? She did really well. I mean, we've had a, a couple issues, but so uh, like this race was just a testament to how strong she is. Braden Dolfo from Langley, BC, finished second in his 100 heat to advance to tomorrow. Courtney Johnson running second from the left now. He would end up in fourth place in this race, but for the first time ever runs a sub-12 100 and some good support from Canadian fans. Kyle Whitehouse on the right in the T38 final. He would finish just behind Edson Pinajero of Brazil, but it's good enough for a Parapan silver medal. Now to the T44 final, Canada represented by Alistair McQueen from Ottawa. Third from the left. And a huge effort, which was good enough for fifth place, and with that, another Canadian record. Earlier in the day on the infield, Kevin Strybosch won silver in the men's discus. He wanted to share this moment with his coach. It feels fantastic. Like, I just want to thank my coach, Jason Tonks, and for all the support he's done and put the time in to make me a silver medalist at the Pan American Games. Another medal now from Jackie Marciano of Halifax. Bronze in the 400. I just had a plan to hit my split for the 200 and just keep running, hold on and save something for the finish. Because, uh, I don't know, I feel like I have a good finish. I just need to build up some more speed. <laughs> and to round out a heavy metal day at the track, Isaiah Kristoff, bronze in the 100 meter final. On to table tennis we go. Martin Pelche, far court, in tough against Jaime Herra of Chile. Pelche goes down three games to none. Barry Butler from Ottawa also lost by the same count. Better luck on the next court over. Stephanie Chan of Richmond, BC. And she loses a point on this rally, but will end up beating her Argentinian opponent in three straight games. She also won in the afternoon to advance to the finals. Another good performance from Masood Mojahad. As he beats his Costa Rican opponent handily, 11-1, 11-3, 11-9. Over to Bocce and some tense games against the host Mexicans. Metal favorite Brock Richardson showing some good skill here. Moving the red ball away from the jack. Adam Dukovic from London with another savvy shot as he knocks off his Mexican competitor. Also Dave Rocher from St. Julie, Quebec. Happy about this call. He was also a winner on day number two.